Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Kayla, and if you're interested in lifestyle videos sprinkled with magic, then go ahead and hit that subscribe button. As you can tell by the title of today's video, we are doing a long-awaited updated Stony Clover collection. And you guys, my Stony Clover collection has definitely grown a lot since my last collection video so let's just let's just go ahead and get into it okay but i'm gonna preface this video and just say that i'm not gonna be sharing any of the target stony clover collection items i'm only gonna be focusing on the stony clover items so anyways let's just go ahead and get into it i'm gonna start from like the smaller items and then get to like the bigger items that i have so let's dive in so first I wanted to share just like the random kind of items that I have. So I have like a bunch of random patches that I just, I don't know what to do with, honestly. This first one is a Mickey and Friends patch and this was a freebie from the newest Mickey and Friends collection that they came out with and I spent like so much money that they gave me a free patch so I just have this one I'm not entirely sure what I'm gonna do with it because I don't really see myself honestly patching this on anything but like it's nice to have so I just have this and then next I have this Minnie Mouse patch that I have and I think it's really cute it's like the circle Minnie Mouse patch and then it says Minnie Mouse on the red border here if you guys can see and this one's really cute I thought I was gonna buy it to patch it on my Minnie Mouse small pouch that I have but I don't know I kind of just like the pouches is so I think I might want to like buy a small black mini or something and stick it on there but I don't know we'll see but I really like this patch so that's why I wanted to purchase it so love this one the next patch that I have is actually something that I bought like intentionally because I want to patch it on something but I don't have the item that I want to patch it on yet but it's basically this little K here and this is from the floral collection it has like the purple flower print and then a gold trim so I really really like this I forget the exact color that it is but I want to patch it on like the lilac wallet but I haven't purchased the lilac wallet yet because I'm waiting for like a sale or something to get it so for now I'm just holding on to this K patch but I just think this K is so 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 pretty I just I just love it those are the patches I have and then I have two scrunchies so the first one Cassie actually gave to me it is the little mermaid scrunchie and I think it's so adorable Hopefully you guys can see, but it basically just has Ariel on there and then flounder and a bunch of other little like sea things like shells, starfish, bubbles, all that good stuff. And these are so cute. I think it's like just a really cute bracelet. I don't know how good it's like in my hair. I don't usually wear these because I don't want to like ruin it. I honestly kind of just wear it as a bracelet when I do wear it. But the other one that I have is the Daisy Scrunchie. And I just think it is so cute because it's purple. It has Daisy and it also has like the Daisy flowers on there. So I love this one. It is so adorable. But yeah, I try not to get the scrunchies as often because I don't wear them as much. But the ones that I have, I do really love. <laughs> Now let's go ahead and move on to all of the pouches and fanny packs that I have. And you guys, I have a lot, but I just wanted to show you guys really quickly. I store them in this like clear container from Target. I know a lot of people talk about these to like stack them. And I think there's also a thin one that people like to put on top of this. So you can kind of like store your patches and like other accessories. But I just have one and all of my pouches and fanny packs fit pretty perfectly in here. So I just have one for now, but that could always change in the future. But let's dive into the pouches. So the first pouch that I wanted to share with you guys is the one I'm currently using. It is this little seashell mini pouch and it has like this, I think this is like terry cloth material, like towel material, but it basically has this seashell patch already on here like it already came like this it's basically like a little pinky purple color and then it has a white border here if you guys can tell hopefully you guys can tell and it has gold hardware so i really really like this pouch this is the one i've been using most recently and i always like to carry a mini pouch with me to just carry all of like my essentials so i can just take it from purse to purse so like if I'm carrying my jumbo fanny I could put it in there or if I carry a purse I could put it in there and it just has everything that I need in here so I love carrying these little minis and this is the one I've been using lately so I love her here's like what everything else looks like it basically fits in here pretty perfectly but 
let's start with the minis. I only have two other mini pouches. So I have the floral collection pouch. I forget which exact pattern this is. I'll like leave it somewhere on the screen, but I basically have a full set of this pattern, but I really love it. I brought it with me to France, but I think it's just so pretty. It basically has like a bunch of purple flowers on there, and then the background color is like a really, really, really pale lavender color. So I just think it's really pretty, and then again, it has like the gold hardware on here. You guys already know what these look like, but it pretty much looks like that. It has like the SCL logo on here. So this is the second mini pouch that I have. And then the third mini pouch that I have is actually the first or like one of the first few Stony Clover items that I ever purchased, but it's basically this nude pouch. And then I patched a Minnie Mouse patch on here. I don't know which size this one is, honestly, but I think it's like the smaller one, but I just think it looks so perfect. And this, of course, is the mini pouch that I bring with me whenever I go to the parks. I love this color. I do want a few more pouches in this color, but I think it's just so perfect and I don't know if you guys can see, but I already have like some makeup stains on here that I'm sad I can't get off, but either way, I really, really like this pouch. It is... It's just so adorable and it's perfect for the park. So like whenever you see me in Disneyland, I'm always going to have this pouch on me. <laughs> Moving on to my small pouches, I have four small pouches. So... Oops. So let's go ahead and start with the first small pouch that I've purchased. I actually really, really like this size. Like I like to use these small pouches to kind of carry all of like my wires and stuff, like my phone charger, my computer charger, like all the chargers that I need. It just like fits nicely in here. And I love traveling with Stony Clover because it just has like a bunch of little compartments to catch everything. So I just love it. But anyways, this is the first small pouch that I ever purchased and it is the Ariel print from the princess collection and I love it you guys saw the scrunchie that I have earlier but I just love this print so much I think it is so cute hopefully it's picking up the color nicely but it's basically this teal color and then it has Ariel flounder Sebastian and then all of like these little seashells and bubbles on here so I really really love this small I think this is a really really great size and I believe if you are a parent this is a really great size to store some of your diapers in here I am not a mother I don't know this from experience but some of my mommy friends they've stored their diapers in a small pouch so I love this one moving on to the floral small pouch that I have you guys already saw the matching mini pouch that I showed you guys earlier but I again really really like this pouch I think it is so pretty I just like can't get over like all of the little floral purple flowers I just think it is so 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 pretty it kind of just like reminds me of like watercolor flowers so either way i just think that this pouch is like absolutely stunning and i love her i also brought this pouch with me to france and i absolutely loved using this so really happy with this one the next small pouch is my most recent small pickup and this is from the toy story collection the coveted buzz print and i actually added a patch on this one if you guys saw my recent pack with me video you guys would have seen me patch this on i don't think it's gonna stay but i mean it's okay for now but either way i have the green alien men patch on here and it says the claw and then the print i'm gonna show you guys the back it is a really pretty like pastel blue color and then it has buzz on there and then the little green alien men and kind of like a little retro design on there if you guys can tell and this is actually like the only gunmetal like hardware that I have in here and on this one as you guys can see it has the little Pixar ball on there and then on the back it has again the stony clover logo on there hopefully you guys can see but I really like this pouch and I just like love as you guys can tell I really like having a set of certain prints because I just think that they're so cute and I really really love the green alien men I don't know why but they're just so cute to me so I love this print so 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 much and again 
can't go wrong with a small pouch. And the last small pouch that I have is from the second Mickey and Friends collection, I believe. Like, not the first one, but it is this adorable Minnie Mouse print. And I just think that Minnie looks so cute. Like, she is wearing her classic little polka dot dress, and then it's a white background. And then it has a bunch of different, like, I think these are primary color hearts on there. But I think this pouch is so adorable, and I really love it. And again, it has the gold hardware, as you guys can see, on the zipper. But there's, like, a little Mickey there. And then on the back, it says Stony Clover. But this is the last small pouch that I have. And I really just wanted something in this print because I thought it was so pretty. I was debating whether or not I should have got like the jumbo or like the Dylan purse that they have. But I just opted out of getting those. So I just got the small. But either way, I'm really happy to have this print in my collection because I think it's just so adorable. So love her. And we're moving on to my large pouches. I only have two large pouches and I actually really really want to get another large pouch but the first large pouch that I have here is the Ariel print again you guys I just love having cute little matching sets but this one again is like one of the first Stony Clover items that I ever purchased it has the same Ariel print but I actually added my initials on here I don't really like to patch a lot of things like I feel like the things that I mainly would patch are the little pouches and I don't know just like for all of my fanny packs I don't really have them patched as you guys will see but I feel like on a pouch it's cute and like when you have like your little travel pouches out and then it has like your initials I feel like that's just so cute so anyways I have my initials on here and I think it looks so cute and if you guys see any of my Disneyland pack with me videos you guys would know that I always love to fit my Minnie Mouse ears in here I believe it fits like six but I think you can kind of squeeze an eight in there if you guys have like a specific set of ears but either way I love <laughs> I feel like I'm saying this for every single pouch size, but I do really love this pouch size as well because not only do I use it for my ears when I'm traveling like on the plane, but I also use these for like my outfit changes. So if I have another outfit change, I'll pack the whole entire outfit in here and it just fits perfectly and it's just like an easy place to store your outfit change for the parks. <laughs> but okay. Love this size, love this print. And the second large pouch that I have is the only clear front that I have, but it's part of the floral collection. Again, the purple print I absolutely love. But again, of course, what's different about this pouch is that it has like this like clear compartment here in the front. And I love using this one for all of my toiletries. So I'll put in like all of my skincare, like my toothbrush and like my retainer and all of that good stuff in here. It also fits a curling iron, which is really, really great. Like I brought this with me to France and I feel like so much in here. And I just love how you can see everything that's in here. Cause I feel like with like your toiletry bag or like your makeup bag, you get a little lost cause you have so much stuff in there. So I love having this one for all of my toiletries. So either way, I really like having this clear front pouch. I really want a clear front like small or something but maybe in the future if I see like a colorway that I like but either way loving this clear front large pouch and again I just feel like a little matching set here just looks so cute so moving on to all of my fanny packs let's do my most used stony clover that I always use my jumbo Fanny and I absolutely love this thing. I pretty much carry it with me everywhere. I just have a black jumbo fanny and again I carry this with me pretty much everywhere like this pouch with my little mini is like my go-to bag pretty much like it's just such a staple and I just love accessorizing this with like a little keychains and I think it just looks so cute and if you guys are interested also in like a size comparison video from the jumbo to the regular stony clover fanny pack I do have a video on that so definitely check it out I'll leave it somewhere in the cards but either way I love this thing this is just like such an amazing size it fits like all of my essentials and more so I love this one I really really want the denim jumbo like I feel like I see that fanny pack in my future but again I'm waiting for a sale so for now I'm happy with this black one and also I think I've already mentioned this but I love how stony clover predominantly has like gold hardware because I am a gold hardware girly so I just love this jumbo okay love it and moving on to all of my regular stony clover fanny packs here we go 
all of my regular stony clovers are basically just the princess collection as you guys will see i have accumulated basically the whole entire collection so let's dive into it the first one is this beautiful jasmine print i love her this was the first fanny pack i ever purchased from stony clover i just think this lilac color is so so pretty and then it has like the magic carpet on there genie and then the lamp and then a boo and all these other little cute details and i just i love her she's so pretty i just love this color so much and i don't know i probably just could never get rid of her because i love the color so much so she's here to stay the next princess fanny is the Ariel fanny pack and this is actually probably my most used princess fanny because I bring this to Hawaii with me all the time and I also just feel like this is the perfect summer fanny pack because like you know tropical beach vibes I love that so this one has definitely been really really loved as you guys can see it kind of has like some fade marks I don't know or like dirt marks I tried to wash this one time like in the washing machine and you guys I would not recommend doing that because it twisted up like the strap here so don't do that okay learn from my mistakes but again I feel like just having a matching set is just so cute so satisfying and I wish they made like minis of the princess collection like that would just be such a slay but either way love this the next princess fanny that I have is this Tiana one and I absolutely love this shade of green like it's not too green it's kind of like more of like a sage green kind of like matcha color vibes but either way it has Tia on there hopefully you guys can see her and then it has Ray yeah I think that's his name Ray and then it has like a frog on there and like the lilies and then the evening star Evangeline so I really love this one I think it is so pretty again like the shade of green is really pretty like I don't really like too 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 bright green so I feel like they did Tiana really really well with this fanny it's just like a muted green so I love this one on to the newer princess fannies that I haven't shown you guys so the first one is this Belle fanny pack and I think again this is just such a pretty shade of yellow I feel like they did such an amazing job with the princess collection because they just chose like the perfect shades of each color like this yellow isn't super 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 bright so I really like this one it has Belle, Books, Mrs. Potts, Lumiere, um, Cogsworth Oh, wait, it does. Okay, so Lumiere, Cogsworth, and then a rose, and then a bunch of little hearts. And it even has Chip, which I love. I think this one is so adorable. I wore this to Disneyland Paris because, you know, like, Belle, French vibes. So I really love this one, and it's just so cute. So we love her. The next fanny pack is the Cinderella fanny pack. And again, I feel like I'm a broken record, but I just love the shade of blue that they used. And I just love all the little details that they have. Like, they really killed this collection. Like, I'm really waiting for a princess collection part two. But this one has Cindy on there and the carriage and a pumpkin and the clock striking midnight and her glass slipper and Jacques and Gus and like the little birds. So I love this one. And I just love how she looks like it's just like a cute little pop of blue so I'm really really happy with this one also I want to give a huge shout out to my friend Christina because she gave me a gift card to Sturdy Clover for my birthday and one that was like the most thoughtful gift ever two I was able to use it towards these two fanny packs during the Stony Clover Saturday sale so we love these so shout out to you Christina love you and then we have the last two princess fannies in my collection first we have the snow white one i believe i got both of these off of like mercari i think so this is the snow white one and this is actually probably the most like neutral color fanny pack that i have besides the black one obviously but i really like it because the background color is like a really it's kind of like off-white i guess i would say and then of course it has miss snow white and then i want to say that's like dock i don't know which dwarf this is and then it has like all of the little woodland creatures and then a pie and then a bow and then of course the apple so i really like this one i forget how much i actually purchased this for but i did buy it pre-loved like from mercari and i believe i got a pretty good deal for it so if you guys are looking for any of the princess fannies then definitely look on like mercari Poshmark, like Depop, like all of those resale sites or even like the Facebook groups because sometimes you get lucky and you find them for like a really really amazing price so definitely just keep a look out there and I also forgot to show the little zipper detail that they have for this collab but this one basically just has a little crown on there which I think is really cute and stony clover as always <laughs> so 
This is the Snow White fanny. And the last princess fanny in my collection is the Sleeping Beauty one. This was the last one that I got because I wasn't even sure that I wanted this one at first because I'm not really a pink girly. Like, if you guys know me, I don't really, I don't, I don't really like pink all that much. Like, I think it's just not for me. But lately, I feel like I've kind of been, like, growing to love pink a little more lately. So, I mainly got this one because I wanted to wear it specifically to Disneyland Paris because her castle is a Sleeping Beauty castle. And then inside the castle, there's, like, a bunch of stained glass windows. Check out my Disneyland Paris vlog if you guys haven't seen it already. But I wore this there, and it was absolutely perfect. And I'm so lucky that I found this one because I'm pretty sure this is probably like the most popular Disney princess fanny because I had such a hard time finding it for a good price but luckily I connected with someone who was able to or who so kindly sold it to me for retail price basically so I'm just so happy with this one but I actually really do like the shade of pink that they chose it's like a very like muted pink and then Aurora's dress is a little bit more vibrant and then it has flora fauna Meriwether and then roses and then all these little stars and I actually really really like this print like when it came out I really liked it I think mainly because it had like all of the fairies on there so I just really liked how this one looked and I really like the shade of pink because if you guys know the like all of the princesses all over print that they have I think that backpack is actually like a lot more pink let me show you okay so I have the backpack here but this is not for me this is for my niece for her birthday but I just want to show you guys like I think that the pink in the Sleeping Beauty fanny pack is a lot more of like a pale pink compared to the little backpack here but I'm pretty sure my niece is not watching this video but shh, don't tell her that she's getting this for her birthday what a lucky girl <laughs> But anyways, this is the last Princess Fanny that I have. Again, I'm really, really hoping that they make a Disney Princess Collection Part 2 because I need a Mulan Princess Fanny. So work on that, Sony Clover, okay? Those are pretty much all of my fanny packs. I do have one other bag to show you or like little bag to show you. I have this Daisy bow bag and I actually really really love this thing. I need to use her more but it has like this really pretty vibrant purple color with Daisy on the front and then all of the little daisies and polka dots and then it has like this bow top handle detail which I think is really really cute and guys this actually fits a lot like I made a TikTok or like a reel about it so check that out but it fits a lot like I can fit my vlog camera in here and a mini pouch and that's just like amazing and like my phone so I love this thing like and also I just really like the little bow detail because like when you see it on top it just looks cute so I'm really really happy with this bag this is like the first kind of like handbag that I have from Sony Clover like not a fanny pack basically so I'm really happy with this one it fits a lot and I'm really happy that I got this because I feel like this sold out really quickly and it's like not available anymore and I was debating between like the fanny pack and the bag but I'm really glad I purchased this one because it's just so cute and it has just like such a fun detail and it's something like a little bit different than I have already in my collection so I love her. The next item is something new, but also something random. But if you guys know me, you guys know I love to play tennis. And Stony Clover recently had a tennis collection. So I just had to get this cover <laughs> for my tennis racket. But I just thought it was so cute. It's like the same nude color that I have on the mini. And it has like this white trim here. If you guys can tell up close, it has like this little white trim detail. And then I, of course, wanted to customize it. It just has like my initials on here and a little star because I'm a tennis star. But I love this so much. I haven't even used it yet because I actually need to buy my own racket. Like I've been using my mom's racket for the longest time. So this is motivation for me to actually get my own racket. But I love it. It. it has like the same quality as the pouches and it has like a nice little strap so whenever I get a racket it'll fit in here nicely and then when I play tennis I could just like carry it like this cute she's a tennis star this was definitely like a really random item and definitely more of a splurge item but I am really happy that I got her because I think she's just so cute and like who wouldn't want a stony clover tennis racket cover 
I don't know, but I love her. I'm so happy I got her. The one thing I will say is that I do wish I did like the bigger letters because I think that would have looked a little better, but either way, I'm really happy with her. I might honestly add like additional patches around, like that might be really cute, but we'll see. Catch me on the tennis courts with this racket cover. You guys, we made it to the last two items and my backpacks. We'll start off with the mini backpack I have. I love this thing, you guys. Like, I brought this on my recent trip with me to Disneyland. It was so comfortable, and I was really hesitant about getting this backpack because it's made for children, but it actually fits me really, really well. I just had to, like, loosen the strap to the longest, like, length, but it's so comfortable, and I really like how it fits a little bit more than a lounge fly because it's bigger, and it also has, like, a separate water bottle pouch here so I'm really happy with it again it just has like this buzz print which I think is really really cute and again it's just like so comfortable I'm in love with this thing I am debating whether or not I want to get like a more neutral color one but I'm still really really happy with this one I also just feel really cool that I have this in my collection because this sold out really quickly so I'm really happy I was able to snag this because I love it the last stony clover is this lilac classic backpack that I have and I did buy this on Amazon for like a sale like I think it might have been like last prime day or something but either way I'm really really happy I got this because this is my travel backpack like I cannot not travel with this anymore I love it so much it just fits so much in here and like it doesn't have like a water bottle compartment but it has like a big compartment in the back and then like a little compartment here and it's just so comfortable and so cute like I brought it with me I pretty much have brought it with me on all of my trips ever since I got it and I absolutely love it it's just so cute so comfortable and again I just I just love traveling with Stony Clover so and I'm also really glad that I didn't patch it because I could just like add cute little fun keychains and it just makes it look really cute really accessorized and I love it I'm so happy I have her and you guys that pretty much wraps up my whole entire Stony Clover collection if you guys made it to the end of this video like give me a purple heart down below in the comments because I know this was a long one but I hope you guys enjoyed this video I loved filming this and kind of just like re-shopping my own collection and I also really love watching videos like this I'm really happy that I was finally able to film this for you guys and I just I just love Stony Clover so much like me Cassie and Ingrid we literally have a group chat about Stony Clover called Stony Clover Girls and we talk about Stony Clover all the time because we're obsessed but I just love Stony Clover so much like everything that they come out with is like so so stinking cute and I'm obsessed with like the quality like the fabric is so nice the zippers are so nice and you can just tell like when you use Stony Clover versus like not Stony Clover it just really makes a difference so I'm obsessed I love it I also feel really really lucky that I have a collection like this and I've worked hard to have a collection like this because I know Stony Clover is not a cheap addiction to have, but I do really think it's worth the money and I do think that you guys should treat yourself once in a while, so yeah. But I'm going to go ahead and wrap up this video here because I've been talking for like the past hour and a half. I'm exhausted, but I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys liked it, please go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Let me know down below in the comments what is on your Stony Clover wish list. I would absolutely love to know. As I mentioned in the video earlier, I would love the denim jumbo. I would love a classic sized duffel. I would love, I would just love a lot, okay? But let me know what's on your wish list in the comments down below. Be sure to hit that subscribe button so you never miss a video from me. Let's stay connected. Follow me on my socials. We both just Kayla's Ever After. And I hope you guys are having an amazing day. I love you guys so much. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.